down. Oyster number one, Kathy. You've got a light pop there. And there's your mother of pearl. So you can see the little pearl blister, but there's no pearls on that side. And if we have a squidge in here, you've got a TARDIS blue, and there's no more in that one. Now, what I'm going to do is you've got your TARDIS blue here, but I'm going to do your uh, gifted pearl as well, just so I don't forget. So in here, we've got a pink pearl as your gifted pearl. So that's going to be in the sand as well. So TARDIS blue and pink from your first oyster and gifted pearl. Moving on to oyster number two. Gorgeous pop with that one. Oh, and a backwards runaway dark pearl there. So there's no pearls on that side. And a dark one here, so if we have a squidge in here. There's no more in that one. Again, the dark section's just part of the oyster. And you've got a darker gunmetal grey. Again, he's almost black, but I am going to say more of a darker gunmetal grey there. Your next oyster. You've got a lighter pearl. And there's your mother of pearl. And, oh, straight away down the bottom there. Oh, okay, so he's got an imperfection on him. But let me just have a squidge. And there's no more in that one. So he's like a silvery olive green, Kathy. He's a really quite interesting colour, this one. Beautiful light silvery olive green. And then you've got this little imperfection. So it's like a little, uh, it's not a hole, but it's like a little indent. And then um, looks like it's stretched out slightly, but the actual impact of the, like the indent is smaller, if that makes sense. But the colour itself is a silvery olive green. Your next oyster. Softer pop there. And there is a pearl blister in there, but again, we can definitely see there's no pearls there at all. And in here, We've got a darker chocolate, and there's no more in that one. So quite a nice dark, deep-toned chocolate there. Moving on to your next oyster. Again, a lighter, sharper pop there. And right down the bottom, I can see a peeper, but we'll just show you the top. So there's no pals on that side. And you've got a lilac, lavender, oh, sorry, a lavender pal there. And there's no more in that one. So far, all single oysters uh, with this opening. So a lavender and then four oysters to go so your next one crunchy pop with that one again there's a little bit of flesh on that side but we can definitely see that there's no pals there and you've got another Lavender pearl, there's no more in that one. 
very similar in size and shade with those two. I think the second one's ever so slightly smaller, but there's not a lot in it. Then moving on to your next oyster. Lighter pop there. And there's your mother of pearl. Now right at the top, we've got a darker pearl there. And there's no more in that one. And he is a chocolatey purple. So base chocolate with a purple overtone. I think on the camera he does definitely look more chocolatey in colour there. And then your next oyster. Slight double pop there. Oh, and we've got a runaway to the side. So you can see that there's no pearls on that side. A runaway dark pearl there. And then if I have a squidge in here for you, Kathy. There's no more in that one. We've got a darker chocolate. And then you've still got one oyster to go. So moving on to your last oyster. Very light pop with that one. And there's your mother of pearl again. So a little bit of a pearl blister, but there's no pearls on that side. And you've got one, two, three, and four. And there's no more in that one. So your last oyster, you are quadding. Right, let me dry these up for you and then we'll go through all of the colours again for you, Cathy. And then if you know which colours you'd like where now, let me know and I can obviously get that all booked in for you. If you prefer some time to think about it, you can take a screenshot and then email me your colour choices across. And any colour swaps, that's not a problem. We can do that for you. So from your quadding oyster, you've got a chocolate, uh, silver and olive green pearl. A autumn peach, slightly two-toned autumn peach. A hot pink and a TARDIS blue. So from the top, you've got the pink, TARDIS blue, gunmetal grey, silver olive and the two-tonal chocolate twinning or oh no sorry not twinning but two lavenders and then two chocolates one's darker one slightly lighter chocolate silver and olive green autumn peach bright pink and a tardis blue so i'll need to know kathy if you're happy with these colors they are yours if you're not happy we can swap them for you for colors of your choice running them through the board your darker chocolate is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven he's a 